Hello everyone, I hope you are. Well. This is Coins Kid. Just gonna love into XRP once again. Thank you, support. Okay, big old coins kid crew. So right now XRP is trying to carve out the bottom. You are conforming to resistance just here. We've got the 10 EMA on the weekly time frame coming down as resistance, and then we're holding this ascending level support at the moment where we keep wicking off it. Wick there, wick there, wick there, wick there. Okay, so there is a bit of support here for XRP, and we we are trying to carve out some kind of bottom down here and some kind of potential ascending triangle that if you do start to see XRP come up and close on the weekly time frame above that key level resistance just there. At 38672 don't anticipate you beginning a retracement here to a minimal 20 ema and the 236 fib but like i said to you when you was all the way down here you know i think that you you know a lot of greed bulls make money bears make money but you was really really overextended down here you know the the, the emas for one you was a massive gap really really far away from them and equally the rsi was in the floor you know historically whenever the rsi in the weekly time frame is really oversold down here for any of the projects it's always a good little area to just put some bids in or you know take a little long opportunity and so far so good we're coming up off that okay so we are running into key resistance we are holding this to support so you've got some kind of volatility break here you know you've got some kind of compression leading to expansion you've got 10 coming down you've got this support so something's going to give here over the next couple of weeks you're either going to see a break to the upside or you're going to see a roll and if you do start to see another roll here you know all you got to do is come on your charts and drop the fibs in and this would be your high this would be your low and you're another, looking at another impulsive push to the downside losing these lows and your bare minimal target would be 0.23204 for xrp if that you know scenario plays out right now that this is simply a push this is a retracement and you're looking for continuation that would be a target for me at 023204 but you know i can't tell you conclusively what xrp is going to do at the minute you're calling up you're calling up something's going to happen okay so for me personally i've been you know spot buying xrp since these lows i am building some long positions as well because i think that what we've got here is some kind of coiling up and we're looking for a break to come up into key resistance 236 and this white line here now why this white line here and I, and I said this to you as you were coming down there you was falling you were falling i said to you what you've done here is lost this key support and you've not back tested it as resistance so there's a bit of confluence here that you know you're calling up for a breakout up into this key resistance where i would expect a major sell-off at that point because that is a major level of resistance right there which is this previous low uh, you know this key previous support becomes resistance that's what i'm trying to say to you so you know this could be a big wave up and then a retracement back down and then you carve out that bottom like that okay and this is just a larger ascending triangle over a longer period of time like this a potential scenario if we do start to see that it's the opposite of this whopping big downtrend okay that we've got this is a big big whopping reversal pattern over a long period of time which i said to you and essentially what you are seeing right now you know is a sort of smaller version of a potential larger version that we will potentially see over a long period of time which is what you want to see the structural bottom it's an indication you're getting price compression compression pop out basically and we're kind of getting that at the moment so again no guarantees if xrp does start to come down and loses this trend line which it's currently not okay it's holding it if it does start to come down and loses this trend line start to close like that down then i would say okay we've got another impulsive push to the downside here and i've just given you a target 0236 there for for xrp but xrp's done everything it needs to to bottom out here okay so like i said to you we need to see the reversal pattern the structure come in hold and back test the support of the lows and at that point coil up and start to break out come back coil up break out come back coil up break out so on and so forth and slowly but surely move upstairs for xrp because like i said to you if you do start to break out here and this is your low what you've got is a projection on the 1618 it's six dollars 52 for, for xrp and, and from these lows uh down here that we put in on june the 18th you're looking at a beautiful uh move of around about 20 uh, 2000 percent there for xrp so i'll keep you updated as best i can so you know come to your charts draw this level of support draw this level of resistance break those with resistance you've got a fantastic long opportunity in front of you lose that support you've got another impulsive push to the downside and the correction is not over yet for xrp and it really is that simple okay take care everyone back soon with an update on xrp stay off safe stay tuned bye bye